Hey everybody, it's Daniel here and today we are back with another customizer Android. So I'm going to be changing up the format of this series a little bit. I'm going to be trying to get through more home screens starting with the next video. And in order to do so, I'm going to shorten the amount of time I show every home screen. And instead of showing the full on explanation, I'll give a brief description of the home screen and then have the instructions in the description down below, probably in the Google Docs. So let's get right into our first home screen. This was submitted by Taran Sony. I'm sorry if I got your name wrong. I'm actually pretty bad with names. But this home screen is super clean and simple. It does not have a dock, so you'd have to turn that off. And once again, you would need to have overlapping widgets in your home screen setup. So for this, you would need Nova or Apex. What he has is a rectangle widget that he created. I will link to that down below. And inside that, he uses Min Icon Pack. However, for my version, I have changed that to Ycons. That's just a personal preference, but basically, he's using a white icon pack. And then he has a clock widget from the Min for Zuper Pro pack. This widget is very clean. He, however, has changed the font of the actual time. I also did that to one I like. He didn't specify which font he used. However, you can go to the Google Plus post and ask him which font he used. Anyways, this is all over a red, blue, and gray wallpaper. I think it looks super clean. And I think that the removal of the dock is actually a very nice touch. And I think it helps add a nice layer to this home screen. So before we move on to the next home screen, I'd like to give a shout out to Slick Wraps for sponsoring this video. They have skins and cases for a multitude of devices. Right now I'm rocking a Spigen Killer Case from the Galactic series with a Darth Vader facet on the back of my OnePlus 3 and I think it's awesome. Definitely be sure to check that out and many more in the description down below. Thank you! Alright, now on to our second home screen. This home screen is a lot easier to set up. It's actually nothing very special but I think it looks super clean and I actually am a very big fan of it. So this home screen was submitted by Leander, and uh, I'm sorry, but I'm not even going to attempt that last name. This home screen is made up of a widget that's actually not a Zuper widget. It's called Form Clock Widget. We reviewed it a while back, almost actually two years ago when it came out on Android. And it's still a very nice looking widget. He seems to have a blue color scheme going with some sort of maroon. And then he has his app icon sorted into a 3x5 grid with Ycons and this looks very clean. This is all on top of a mosaic wallpaper that he has blurred out. He's using the landscape extension which looks very clean in my opinion especially with the amount of blur he's added. Now he hasn't given me any specifics as to what his mosaic settings are however I'm sure that if you comment he would be able to give you this information. Another thing to note is that this setup has taken away the dock and uses a 7x7 grid to allow for this many icons. Anyways guys that's pretty much all for this video thanks for checking it out I'm sorry that it was kind of short I will try to make longer episodes with more home screens in the future. For all the information on home screens 1 and 2 please look in the description and until the next time guys stay fresh.